Hello, what's going on guys? This is CJ. Welcome back to another video on my channel. Today in this video, I'm going to be showing you an unlimited revive glitch in Call of Duty Cold War Zombies. Alright guys, if you guys haven't already, leave that like, I would appreciate it. This is pretty easy, and as you can see in the background gameplay, I am not losing any revives at all. Now, keep in mind, it does go away after 99, so if you're a really bad player, um, then you'll probably go through these pretty quick, but you could do Easter eggs, you could do anything your heart desires, all Easter eggs work, this works on any map, and every single map that there is, you could do Easter eggs, so yeah, without further ado, let's get into this thing. Alright guys, what you guys are going to do to start off this glitch is you are going to have your friend go into multiplayer and go to custom games. Once your friend goes to custom games, he's just going to simply invite you, okay? Now once he invites you, you're just going to accept, alright, you're going to accept that invite. Once you accept that invite, you're going to end up in your friend's lobby. Once you're up in your friend's lobby, tell him to just simply leave alone. Once he simply leaves alone, you are going to be by yourself, okay guys? Now, if you get an error that says you lost connection to the party, don't worry about it. It's not going to make it where you can or cannot do the glitch. If you get it, fine. If you don't get it, that is also fine as well. The glitch will work exactly the same. All right, guys. Now, if you get this alert, just click dismiss. All right, guys. Then you guys are going to go and go down to edit game rules. All right. Click X on that. Click X on settings. Once you click X on settings, you're going to click your options button to open up this little pop-up on the side. All right, guys. Now, once you've done that, what your friend is going to do is he's going to be on the multiplayer screen where he can select any, uh, like a caption or anything like that. So all he's going to do is just go to go back down to custom games. Once he goes back to custom games, what he's going to do is he's just going to simply invite you. Now, when he invites you, you have to do it through the game. You have to try to accept it through the game. If um, you're on PlayStation, obviously, I don't know if it works for Xbox or PC because I don't have an Xbox or a PC. I do have a PC, but I just don't have two PCs to test out between each other. But anyways, um, you have to do it through the game. All right, guys. Now, all you're going to do is once you get on this, it's going to say accept, ignore, or once you press triangle, it's going to say accept, ignore, view player details. You're just going to click X on pu pl view player details. All right. Now, once you are on view player details, your friend is going to send you another one and you're going to do the same thing. You're going to press triangle, go down to view, view player details, and you're going to do that one more time. As you guys can see, all right, I did that one more time. Now he's going to send you another invite, and the fourth invite, you're going to press triangle, and you're going to hover over accept. Once you hover over accept, you're going to have him send you another one, okay? Once he sends you another one, you're going to quickly accept it and spam triangle, all right? Now once you spam triangle, as you can see, it's going to come up with another party invite. What you're just going to simply do is view player details, then you're going to press circle. Alright guys, now if you're on the screen, you have done it right, but don't get too excited yet. There's still more steps to the glitch. Alright guys, now you should be in your friend's session at this stage. You should see on the top where your name usually would be. It'll say 2 out of 12 or 1 out of 12. All right, if it says two out of 12, then you are in your friend's session. All right, now once you're in your friend's sessions, what you're gonna tell your friend to do is, you're just gonna tell him to press circle and what he's simply going to do is bring the party. All right, now once you bring the party, he's you're going to end up, end up just the inbox is gonna go away completely, okay? Now once that happens, your friend is also going to just click circle and just leave alone okay now once he leaves alone he's going to do the same thing again so it's a lot of invites it's a lot of that um basically so you're going to be getting spammed with invites okay so um so it's the same thing again 
your friend's going to invite you you're going to press triangle and just view player details you're going to do the same thing again i'm just doing it pretty quick here to um to speed up the pace all right one more time all right all right now he's going to send you another invite just like we did last time and we're going to press triangle and just hover over accept once we hover over accept we're just going or your friend is going to send you another invite again and you're just going to click x on accept and spam triangle as fast as you possibly can and then right when it shows up what you're going to do is you're going to go to view player details. Once you go to view player details, you're going to do the same thing and just press circle. You should be on this inbox social um, tab again. All right. Now what your friend's going to do is you're going to back out of the in of the social and he is just going to press circle and bring party. All right. Now, once he brings party, what he's also going to do is just going to click on zombies simply. All right. Now, once he clicks on zombies, you should see your ter uh, terrain like change to zombies. So that's another step that you know that you've done it right. If you have like the the, zo the zombie background with the inbox. All right, guys. Now, what your friend is going to do is he's going to go over to private. All right, but he's not going to select any map quite yet. All right. Now what you guys are going to do is you guys are just going to press circle on the screen and you guys should be at the edit game rules with this little tab open. You're just going to press circle to get rid of the tab. Then what you guys are going to do is you're going to go over player and last team go to last team standing. Once you guys go to last team standing, you're going to go to self revive count and pull all the, that all the way up to 92. All right. If you go past 92 or or anything like that or try to do it a little bit um or a little bit more or like 94 it won't work all right guys so make sure you're at 95 once you're at 95 your friend is simply just going to pick a map doesn't matter any map any map all right so in this case i'm going to uh, click mauder totem since i have two consoles all right now I'm gonna press circle and hover over leave alone. All right, right when you hear it counting down, you can hear the t t t. You'll be able to hear it. Let me be quiet so you can hear it. All right, right when you hear that, you're gonna have your friend leave, and then you're gonna go all the way up to 99. Once you go up to all the way to 99 just let off your d-pad and don't do anything all right you're going to hear those clicks again okay once you hear those clicks again your friend's not in there and you're going in alone okay that's means that you have done it right all right guys all right now all i'm gonna do is pick a gun simply all right once i simply pick a gun what is going to happen is i'm just going to load in now usually i should have one revive but what you're going to see here is i'm going to have three okay all right as you guys can see i have three all right now i'm gonna pause it all right guys now you have three okay but you actually have 99 revives, okay? Now, I'm gonna show you, okay? And also, your friend can join too, all right, guys? Just make sure you do not go to a high round, otherwise, your friend won't be able to join you. But I'm gonna now show you that it is not three revives, it is practically 99, as I showed you of the first part of the video. Come on. All right, there you go. Now I'm gonna revive myself. And as you can see, I'm still at three, all right? I'm gonna do this. So as you can see, I can revive myself as many times as I would freaking like, all right? Until I run out of them, unless you go down a almost 100 times, then you'll have a big problem, but yeah, that's about it, guys. If you guys haven't already, leave a fat like. I'd appreciate it. That's pretty much the whole glitch. I know it's a lot of inviting and stuff like that, but hey, this is the best that we got right now, especially with the unlimited revives. I thought it was patched, 
but lo and behold, got a new one here for you, all right? This has been your boy CJ, and I'm out. Peace.